Live One Genesis Writer here, and I want to open up my channel to your Halo 4 films so that you can upload your own films to your file share. Submit them to me through the comment section of this video down below, and basically I can review them, post the video, and maybe it'll help you in your gameplay and help you get better. If you're interested in videos I've already posted, gameplay reviews, click, click on the annotation in the top right hand corner to see a playlist of the reviews, gameplay reviews I've already done. If you're curious and you can click on the link down in the description, it'll take you to the same playlist. Now for those of you wanting to submit your own film to me, here is how you do it. Here is what I am looking for. I am assuming that you've watched this entire video. If you have not watched this entire video, it is your own fault. And um, comments that do not follow the very, very specific instructions I'll be given in this video and messages even that I receive our Xbox Live or Twitter related to submitted gameplays will be immediately deleted if they do not follow the following rules. So please set aside a portion of your time and here we go. What I'm looking for are films that are close, where the ending score is definitely something edgy to where, okay, you know, there, there were two flag caps to three flag caps or, you know, the, the enemy team was only, you know, five to eight kills behind you or something of to that effect. Do not submit gameplays to me where you are stomping the living crud of the enemy team or where you get raped the entire game. Those are not interesting to me and I, I wouldn't want to embarrass you or more so myself by trying to go over a gameplay like that. Um, another thing that I'd really like to throw out there that I strongly believe in is that um, I've been receiving a lot of Slayer and free-for-all games and those are fine and if you want to submit those that is absolutely okay. But I am also very interested in objective-minded games. So capture the Flag, Oddball, Ricochet, whatever you have to submit, please send it my way in terms of that, of obviously abiding by the rules I'm about to state here. But that is the type of film I'm looking for. It's not necessarily where you do amazing or where the enemy team does amazing and stomps you. It's where you edge out a game, like maybe you were in a free-for-all game and you lost barely by one or two kills and you want to know how you could improve or maybe you was in capture the flag and the enemy team won in overtime you're wondering how to stop that or maybe you won in overtime and you're wondering how to make the game a little less close those are the types of films I'm looking to review so now let's get into the more meat and potatoes of the rules that I need you to follow um, basically these are the things that draw my attention away from your film. Camping, general lack of teamwork, not working for the objective, i.e. just getting kills and not going for the objective at all, or at least not even helping your teammates go for the objective. Guest players on any team, okay, I'll repeat that again, guest players on any team, okay, betrayals, teabagging in any shape, form, or fashion whatsoever, players who quit and aren't replaced for a long time on any team, in your film, um, the reason these are things that just draw my attention away from the film. They don't; these do not mean that I will immediately go, "Okay, I'm not going to review your film." Um, though these are just the things that take my attention away from your film. So I've stated the positive things I need you to do and the negative things I need you to not do. Now I'm going to state the things that you absolutely cannot do in your film. Otherwise, it will be immediately taken down, deleted, void. It's not going to be submitted. It doesn't count. Okay. Um, here are these things now. Um, sending me your submission via anything besides this video's comment section, but we're, via that Twitter, Xbox Live, Facebook, or anything else. I don't know how many people are going to send me gameplay reviews over Xbox Live. I will not be taking submissions over Xbox Live anymore. You must submit your gameplay to me in the comment section below of this video, not any other video on my channel, this video, using the template that I will describe to you at the end of this video. Moving on, I'm submitting a map plus game type that has already been submitted. Okay, What I mean by this is a submitted gameplay that I've already reviewed. Let's say I've reviewed a, um, a Scythe Team Slayer game Okay, on the map Scythe, obviously. If you submit a Team Slayer game on the map Scythe, in other words, the exact same game type paired with the exact same map, I'm not going to review it. It's automatically void. I will not review your film. Okay? Because I already technically have reviewed that map in game type combination. Now, it's not just Slayer. Okay? So you could submit, for example, a free-for-all game 
on Scythe, not a Team Slayer game on Scythe, and that would work just fine. You could submit an oddball game on Scythe, that would be fine. Or you could submit a um, Team Slayer game, but on a different map, like a Drift or something of that nature, and that would be fine. Just make sure the game type and map I haven't already reviewed. Again, check this annotation or the first link in the description of this video for the playlist that will show you all the films I've already reviewed. Moving forward, if you submit a non-matchmaking gameplay in a custom game, it is very likely to be immediately deleted, unless you have some significant reason or description otherwise, or it is exact settings taken from matchmaking, including the map and game type. Um, submitting a gameplay without radar. Again, I'm not overly um, opposed to non-radar gameplay. You can submit any sniper or SWAT gameplay you want, even though sometimes those don't have radar. That's fine. But if you submit some throwdown gameplay, that's not what I'm look, looking for. Um, I'm not looking for hyper-competitive, that sort of thing, if you get my drift. Mainly because the majority of the playlists in Halo, please listen very carefully, have radar. Okay? I understand that no radar is much more competitive, much more fair, technically speaking. Okay? But the fact of the matter is, especially with Halo 4's low population at this point, I cannot be sitting here reviewing games that don't have any radar because no one's going to want to watch that because the majority of people playing Halo 4 are playing playlists that have radar in them. And so that's the mainstream I'm trying to be going for. I hope you understand. Um, submitting multiple films in the same submission. This is not an option whatsoever. You must only submit one film per submission. You can have multiple submissions, in other words, multiple comments in the section down below. That's fine, but you must do each of them individually following the exact same format, which I will describe at the end of this video. Also, failing to follow or fully complete the following submission template will get you voided. Your, your comment, your submission will not count at all. Okay? And this really is quite basic, the, um, the stuff that I... The, the, template I'm going to show you. It's very basic. So um, let's jump into that. So right here you can see the submission template. You have the name of the film that you saved it as to your file share. I need your gamer tag exactly spelled out as it is. I need the final score of the game, your team versus the enemy team. What was the final score? If it was capture the flag, you know, was it two to three or three to five? You know, what was it? What was the final score in terms of Infinity Slayer? Was it 560 to 600, you get the drift. But in a free-for-all, just name me the top four players and what their scores were, you know what I mean? And then um, a the loadouts that you were using during the gameplay, if it's applicable, if you can choose your own loadout, um, like an Infinity Slayer, let me know what loadout or loadouts you are using, please. This really helps with um, analyzing your gameplay. And then the last thing is just simply a brief description of the film that you're submitting. It doesn't have to be anything fancy. Just um, oftentimes players just want to include, hey, this is my first game on this map. I, I wasn't really familiar with it. Could you help me out? Or I was really warmed up trying to get my 50 in, in Rumble Pit, and this guy barely edged me out. You know, that sort of thing. Descriptions like that really help me narrow down, okay, you know, this film looks interesting. If this other guy is like, oh, I had a gameplay. Oh, well. You know, it's okay. That, that's, that goes over my head. It, I probably still check your film out, obviously, but convince me to watch your film from some some aspect and give me your own feedback, your own thoughts on the film in general. It doesn't have to be anything long. But guys, um, that template is right here on your screen. That is what I want in the comment section down below. If you don't follow this template or the rules I previously stated, then I won't be reviewing your film. But otherwise, if you have submitted your film or if you're going to, thank you very much. I'm looking forward to watching your submission I check my YouTube comments rigorously every day, and I will go through and watch your film just as soon as humanly possible and reply to you, letting you know what I thought of it, whether it's possible, it may be you know, upcoming in my future series, that sort of thing. Um, and thank you for your time. And I'll see you on the next capture, guys, or whatever I end up recording. Peace.